Well, hello, my YouTube friends and family. So I'm back. Me and hubby get to got to eat. We get to go do our Sephora haul. Since I'm VIB, I got 15% off my total price. And he also got the sample and then picked out the cologne that he really, really loved out of the sample colognes. Now, there is one thing I have a complaint about. <sighs> Sephora really... When people buy these sample kits and get this stuff, you shouldn't have to go to a regular Sephora store. You should be able to do it at the Sephora JCPenney's too. Because we had, didn't know, and I found it in the fine print on the card. Thank God I read. But a lot of people don't understand that. Because if it's a Sephora perks, it should be in all Sephora's. Not just the Sephora that stands alone. So we had to actually drive 35 miles out of our way to cash this in because I'm surrounded by Sephora's and JCPenney's, not Sephora's that stand alone. So by the time you put the gas in, is it worth it? Probably not. <laughs> but anyways, so this is what we ended up getting. He got, and then it's not even the bigger one. It's the 1.7 fluid, ounce, fluid ounces. And he ended up liking the Versace, the Eros Versace. Which I could say has it does come in a nice packaging. And it smells awesome. This is definitely a great smelling male cologne. And this is what he picked out of all the samples. And his second favorite was the U1, which that Sephora didn't have it. And it was really nice to hear. Well, you need to go to another Sephora, really. Well, we didn't have time to travel 30 more miles to get to another Sephora. So we ended up getting that there. And then he ended up buying the bigger box because it's so far away. He wanted to have plenty in stock. So then I ended up getting two Sephora brushes. Everybody keeps saying how nice these are. And I pick differently because some of them are really fluffy. And I like the smaller version. So I ended up getting um, this one here because it's... I like the smaller brushes that are more compacted. So I ended up getting the Sephora. This is the Pro Small Shadow Brush. And the Tapered liner brush. I tend to like the Pro Taper liner brush to do the outer look in the crease. And then this one here, the small shadow brush is what I'll probably pack on the eyelid. Even though they had one a little more bushier, I tend to like the smaller one. So I'm going to try those. And I love it because the girl there matched me up with a really nice shade of Marc Jacobs, which I really like. And this is actually in the shade Sugar and Spice. And I actually got to try this on in the store. So it is a very, very pretty color on me too. And I did wear it when we went to dinner. Can get the box open because I want to show you guys. The one thing I was kind of disappointed of uh, because I do like Too Faced is they did not have a foundation that matches my skin tone. And I was really shocked over that because I take like a late medium and they either had lights or two darks, but there was like no in between. But look how pretty this is. This is a very pretty shade and it is so me. I like the mauves towards the reds. So... I really like this and the casing's really nice and I haven't got to try a Marc Jacobs full lip so I was pretty happy about this and then I need to keep the name of that I'll have to write that down then I ended up asking one of the girls I got the tardiest tart tart lid to start with for some reason, it's the, the clay stuff that doesn't seem to want to, 
or I don't know, it was what it was one of them. It didn't want to blend real well, and they were kind of like before the pigmentation, the heavy ones. And she told me to try this because she doesn't have any problems with it. And I don't particularly have this particular eyeshadow set, so I am looking forward to trying it. She says it's really good, especially for new people. So I'm pretty excited about trying these colors. It smells like chocolate. I like when they smell like chocolate. So this is going to be fun to play with. I really like the girl that helped me at the Sephora. I've always liked the girls that helped me in Sephora. And then I got a sample of the Born This Way in Snow because I have pink undertones. And they have like golden and other colors. And I don't know how this is going to work. But she sent me home with a sample to try. So I'm going to try it. But to me, it looks just a tad too late. I think I need a tad darker because I'm more a in the medium, but like medium, like light medium, like going into the medium, but not real dark medium. And then I ended up getting, this is the one thing I really wanted to try from the Too Faced Festival. I got the Angel Tears. So I can't wait to try this as a lip topper or by itself. And then, upon checking out, she gave a fresh soy face cleanser to try, which is going to be fun for me. And then she gave a spice bomb for my hubby from Victor Rolf. And then, because I had 100 points, I went ahead and chose the Skin 2 Skincare Routine Must Haves. The Facial Treatment Essence and the RNA, RNA Power Cream. So this is going to be fun to try. Hi, Rainy. Sticking your face in here. Say hi, everybody. It's my puppy, Whoopi. So this was my Sephora haul with my 15% off and him to scan. So these are going to be fun to try and show you guys in upcoming videos. So with that, you guys have a great week. Bye.